Hey guys, this is Dr. Brent, and I'm here with Tracy, and she is doing like incredible. So let's kind of walk them through what was going on before you came into the office. Before I came into the office, I was having a lot of issues with my asthma and breathing and coughing, and my RA was flared up to the point that I could barely move. And how long had you been dealing with like the breathing issues or been diagnosed with the RA stuff, or even just had the symptoms of the <laughs> RA stuff? The uh, breathing issues I've had off and on anytime the weather changes since I was 13. Oh my gosh. And so how, so when the weather changed, um, and obviously it was an environmental stressor, challenging your body and your body couldn't adapt, like how, how scary was that? Not being able to breathe is scary. It's really scary because it's, sometimes when it's really bad, when we have lots of tornadoes, then I end up in the ER or the hospital, so. Whoa, okay, and then the RA. So you'd been diagnosed with RA. Yeah, I was diagnosed when I was 28, but I had gone into remission until I had COVID. And I had COVID almost two years ago, and I've since I had COVID, I've just gotten to where I couldn't move at all my whole body. It just went crazy. And obviously you were seeing your rheumatologist, and did they, they had prescribed medications? Yes, I was on, um, I think it was on a total of five RA medicines and probably five asthma medications. Oh my gosh. So, and how, how did you hear about us? Um, a customer came into where I worked and heard my cough and said she had been taking her son um, to the chiropractor for his cough and said I should try it. What was your initial thought when someone <laughs> said see a chiropractor for lung function? I thought they were crazy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but you were desperate and you're like, hey, I gotta try something. Absolutely. So you came in here. We clearly, we, we evaluated your spine. We saw stress to the nerve system that was affecting like the strength and the function of the lungs. And we decided to do something about it. And we went through some corrective protocols. Yes. And so you've been getting adjusted for, has it been just over two months, uh -huh. three months? About two, two and a half. Two or two and a half months. And you kind of told me the results the other day, which is why we're doing this testimony. <laughs> and uh, kind of walk us through, how's the breathing been? Um, I haven't had any trouble with the asthma and I haven't had to use my inhaler. And we just had the tornado. So the yes. seasons are going crazy. Yes. So no I inhaler. Went through a full weather change with no problems whatsoever. First so, time in forever. And, and so what that what that shows us is that her body is her, her body's just getting stronger and healthier. Her, her, her body is able to adapt to the stresses, which which is which is what health is. And then you had just told me too, you had went to your rheumatologist and they did a bunch of lab work. It was my three month follow up to at my rheumatologist and she did all the lab work and all the testing and my numbers on my movement and range of motion have increased and some of my lab work had actually gotten a lot better. So even the RA has been healing because again, when you remove the interference, the body's designed to heal. But when you have that kind of stress in the nervous system, it just, it can't function like it's supposed to. And so she's been getting correction and her body's healing. And so just even your rheumatologist was pretty impressed. She was very impressed, very impressed and asked what I had been doing different. And maybe now she's going to start referring to a bunch of people to chiropractic because she sees how well it works. So anyway, you're just doing awesome. How excited are you about feeling uh, better? I'm very excited that I can move and run around and keep up with my grandbaby. Amen to that. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. We'll talk to you later. Bye.